spam is being more creative nowadays and one of the more creative ways is in Skype which makes it appear that you have requested a translated conversation and so in this video I will show you the, dif the difference between the genuine and what is spam as you can see here there is this random user um, that interacted with me but it makes it look like that I have requested to them a translated conversation as you can see here on the screen this is what it looks like when it is fake I had a separate Skype account so that I can show you what it looks like when it's genuine. How it looks like when it's genuine is that on the top it will show a translated conversation request it has been sent to whoever and waiting for a response. It will show it at the very top. And to verify it was actually you that sent it, you can click on the person's name at the top. Then you can scroll down where it says translation request sent and you can see that it says we've sent your translation request waiting for a response. So that's how it looks like when you yourself actually went to do it. Now let's go back to the fake one, the spam, to show how it looks like. Click on their name at the top, scroll down, and you will see in the translate conversation area that it shows that I had never sent a translation request. And so this is how you know the difference between a fake versus what's real. This one right here, fake. The one that I showed you previously that I sent to myself, that's the real one. So don't fall for it. Be very careful. Stay safe.